So Ty, from Fort Hill to uh, MVP of the Bowl for the Maryland side, how did it feel out there today? No, honestly, not so well at the end. But, mm -hmm. um, you know, it's good. You know, I'm, I'm really upset you know, about the you know uh, the seniors leaving and everything because you know this game was really for them too, and you know also this was a, a game for us going to next year. But um, you know, I feel pretty good about it. But um, still got a lot of things working. Ty, how frustrating was it to have the two red zone opportunities there in the fourth quarter and not being able to punch it and get the shots on? You know, um, BC, you know, they they did their film. They knew who the was going to run. And, you know, yeah, it's frustrating, but BC did a good job and, you know, they stopped us. So you got to do credit to them. How would you characterize his first season with, with Coach Durkin? Energetic, um, painful a little bit uh, here and there, but, um, you know, it's it a great thing with Coach Durkin being here, and he's really put a lot of time invested in us, and we have invested back to him, which is going to make this program great. Yeah, promising, but frustrating at the same time? Yeah, I mean, you got a little bit of both, but, you know, we have big things happening, and once the off season, it's going to be great. Do you, you feel like you, I mean, I know you don't, you ever, you, you rarely talk about yourself in terms of on an individual individual basis, but do you feel like you established yourself this year as one of the top running backs in the Big Ten in the country? I believe I bettered myself on, you know, there's still a lot of things i got to work on, and, you know, thanks to Kenny and Wes, you know, the seniors that are leaving, you know, they really helped me, you know, pick up my game, and you know, I still got a lot of things to work on. As we're talking like that, what did Coach say to you guys in the final year? He said, um, come back ready to work. And he said, it's a tough loss. You know, um, lost by six, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, six. Um, he said, it's a tough loss, but we shot ourselves in the foot a lot of penalties, you know, uh, mental mistakes, the one offense and defense, you know. Um, but all it comes down to us, you know, executing the whole time. And he said, uh, if we played the second half like we did the first half, you know, it might have been a different outcome, but you know you can't change time. You can't go back in time. So you know that's the that's the end result, and we gotta get ready to come back in the winter and work. Take one more for time. Did you ever set a thousand yards as a goal for yourself? Yes, sir. Um, you know, uh, I said about twenty. Uh, one of my good friends told me he said twenty goals for myself. And uh, I do that every year. And I go from short, medium, long. And a short, medium was a thousand yards. And you know, I'm grateful for it. You know, it's a it's a great thing. But you know, it's a lineman. You know, I got the easy part. I just run. You know, I don't have to really do much. If I have to make some little miss or something like that, but you know, those are the guys that get hit in the face every time, play after play. And you know, I gotta give all credit to them. How many of the twenty did you make? Uh, I, I said it back like three weeks ago, so um, I have to say I'm like five right now of 20 because it's a, like five short term, five medium, and then there's a 10 long term ones. Okay. And that's when I'm definitely older too, so uh, you know, we'll get there. Thanks, Thanks Doug. We hit terminus!